welcome or welcome back to my youtube channel so as the title suggests i'm gonna tell you every possible thing related to fashion designing uh, starting from uh, preparing for it till getting a job so without further ado let's get into the video i have divided it into five categories so the first category is preparation if you are in 11th or 12th standard i would definitely suggest you to take up fine arts as an optional subject if you don't have fine arts in your school you could uh, take up like fine arts coaching because that really help you they usually teach you the basics which is life composition still life proportions and all the small details i also would suggest you to appear for an intermediate uh, fine arts exam it just test your skills and uh, boost up your confidence so learning the basics is a must the second category is how to apply when you're prepared with all the basics the next step is how will you apply to get into those design colleges so usually all the top design colleges the um, admission form comes out in december like they start getting out from november december so just keep on checking the websites i would suggest you to apply in uh, two three colleges because at least you will have options then so keep a track of all the admission forms they are mostly online you just need to fill and uh, pay some registration fees so the next thing which comes in mind is what type of questions comes in a design exam so it is also divided into uh, two or three parts the first is a theoretical test in that you need to know basics of everything english current affairs maths and basics of design obviously there are many books available in the bookstore which uh, uh, gives you sample papers of how the questions come so the second part is a design test you need to give your answers conveying through sketches and drawings the third is a studio test where you need to make a practical model using some given materials uh, the materials can be paper straw clay rocks etc it is a kind of best out of waste thing but you need to make it presentable and uh, beautify it so the third category comes when you get enrolled in one of these design colleges which is the subjects what you'll study for 3 or 4 years this obviously differentiate from college to college but the basic uh, subjects are the same in fashion designing the subjects are mainly fashion illustration pattern making draping basics of fashion and textile studies any design starts with basics of fashion you need to know the fashion terminology you need to know the story boards mood boards how to decide a theme then you go to fashion illustration you have a theme in mind you need to sketch it out using fashion crookie so that's fashion illustration for you then comes the drafting it is done using a brown paper so you have a sketch in hand but obviously the fabric is very expensive you can't just experiment on that expensive fabric the brown paper is used for that you just make the shape on the brown paper you get an idea how the garment will look then comes draping draping is done using a muslin fabric which is very cheap again to avoid experimenting on expensive fabrics you use the muslin cloth and make the desired garment on a bodice or a mannequin and the garment is called a toil garment then the final stage comes which is pattern making it includes stitching of the garment differencing the toil garment and the brown paper cuttings the other question arrives at this stage is do you need to know stitching for fashion designing yes definitely even though we grow our business we have tailors but we need to show the tailors how the things are done and for that we need to know how to stitch that garment so while preparing for the exam i would suggest learn the basics of stitching how to stitch a button how to use the basic embroidery etc it will come in handy for sure another subject is textile studies most of the colleges don't have that subject they have a different uh, design category that is textile designing but uh, few of the colleges provide this subject along with fashion designing i think it is necessary because to know how the fabric is made which you are going to use later you need to know the properties of the fabric 
for that textile studies is very important the next category is exams yes fashion designing has exams 90% of the exams are practical you usually work on a collection for a whole year and at the end of the year you have a presentation or a viva explaining your collection from a to z some of the colleges have midterm exams as well which may include some theoretical papers such as basics of fashion or uh, textile studies at the end of your graduation you have a graduation project which includes internship and your final collection the last category is jobs when you complete your college you have campus placement or you can apply outside the college it is divided into sub categories you can either work in retail as a personal shopper you can work under some designer you can work under some brand or you can start up your own business two more options are you can be a fashion illustrator if your illustrations are really good you can go into teaching as well or you can go for your further studies which is post graduation in design there you choose your speciality so if you're very good in uh, pattern making you can take up a masters course for pattern making or there are many options such as fashion styling personal styling fashion management business of fashion etc i hope i have cleared all your doubts if still you have more doubts please do comment and i'll surely answer those thank you for watching this video please do share like and subscribe and stay tuned for more videos